<clears throat> I have 200 hours in Celeste. Holy heck, you're gonna head out, Snowpants? No problem. Thanks for hanging out. Um, ooh, control is already doing shit. Can you? I don't know if you guys can hear it. Quite loud. Um, you have 200 hours in Celeste. You're playing modded levels. Oh, okay. That's a shit ton of hours. You must really like it, Infinite. I'm actually turning a light on in a moment because it's quite dark in my room. Um, run him till he's rub him till he's raw. My poor little cheek. What if his name was Mita Span? <laughs> God. That little taco face. You guys love my little taco face. Oh, he's got a little mud. Oh, the controller. I actually already, I already really like the haptics. They already, like, I haven't even done anything. This little just battle card, you can feel it. So it actually, people have talked about it because it's a series of tiny motors. You can feel it go from different points in the controller to other points. Like it vibrates through the controller. Welcome to Astro's Playroom. So this one's a little of a funny one I feel like showing off because this will be more for me than you guys. So I don't know how much I will show off of Astros, um, but it's very much like, um, if it's kind of meant to be a show off of what this controller can do. And it's one of the things that people have talked about is the most impressive. Um, but yeah, I can, I already can tell this is already impressive for the controller. Oh, wow. I actually felt that kind of build. So it build up, so just, so as you could tell, it sort of started from the bottom of the, like, of the palms and it worked its way up to the top and then collected. So that was pretty cool. Oh. Ah, oh, okay. So yeah, it pretty much is how I, how people were describing. So there's kind of like a, I hit this point here and then I can feel this like tension and then I push a little bit harder and then it clicks. So you can kind of feel it. That's cool. The fact that that's, the controls were quite loose before and now that they, they can do this is pretty impressive. Celeste is definitely one of your top five games of all time. I mean, at 200 hours, I would hope so. But yeah, I have to play it sometime, Infinite. I've, I've t had people talk about it. It's not particularly my type of game, I would say, but it, I am interested in it at least. So maybe we might do a quick playthrough of it or something. Talico? Taco Lico. Ugh. Don't lick the taco, guys. I love to stick around, but I gotta grab some eat. No prob. Hagroys. Hagroys. No prob. Infinite. Thank you for the raid again. You have a great day, man. Touchpad. I'm gonna draw. It. Hang on, we'll draw. It. We'll draw. It. As that. <laughs> As that. That good. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty much, it's just a touchpad, basically. Draw a dick. Okay, so, so what this is showing off right now is, it's got the motion, but it's trying to, because it put the little astros inside, it's sort of rumbling various points of the controller to suggest where they are in the controller. So it's like the right, it's the left. Oh, wow. When you actually shake them around, that actually, so it's actually, it must have really well made, uh... The actual application, not the controller, has 3D mapping done really well, because that I can feel, when I shake them here and I can, they bounce up high enough, I can feel them bounce from the left-hand side over to the right-hand side, even though it's down below. That's cool. It's like the Ice Cube, the Ice Cube Jammer on the Joy-Con. I will say that it's fucking, uh, like... Like, oh, no, I don't want to, oh, I don't like that animation. Um, the Joy-Cons were good, but not amazing. I say the, the, this is way better. This feels way better. But really, it'd just be detecting white noise, not the pressure or anything like that. I have Final Fantasy IX for life, uh, because you have 5,000 hours. Holy shit, mumbin. Do you speed run it or you just you just like playing it over and over? It's like a HD rumble like on the Switch. It definitely is. It's pretty much how I would describe it. It's just better though. Because it's it's got a lot more space to do stuff. The the rumble in the Switch is like, eh. That looks sus. Blow it. 
So, by the way, just to explain this game also, so as this isn't the first Astros, Astros game. We've got one for every console, or is it uh, for, since the three? Or it might be only four in this. I might be wrong. Um, 5,000 hours is one run. What? <laughs> That's a long run. Look at him on his butt. So it's kind of meant to be a celebration um, and a showcase. So it's a bit of a showcase of actual game. Um, and people just, people find it quite fun. Oh man, he's got little tippy taps. Every sing so guys, every single time he walks, I can feel those little tippy taps in the controller. I don't know if this would get annoying in some games. I feel like this game would probably be one that overdoes it just to make a, like an example of how it functions. But every single time he, he walks, I can feel little tippy taps in my hands. This is what I was talking about. This is where it's hard because this is something I'm going to have to be very descriptive of because, um, it's, it's, it looks like a simple game on just to you guys, but there's a lot more going on to me. Okay, I see. One button, two button. Ooh. Square. Square punches. Okay. Grab with square as well. Okay. How is that it haptacular? It is amazing. It actually quite it feels really nice actually. It's not too much. It's kind of a very soft vibration. It's not like so you know how when you get vibration sometimes and you're in a cutscene and you put down your controller and you just hear it go brrrr. It's not like that. Because in the older controllers, how it actually functioned was like um that looked like the inside of a computer. Um the way it used to function in the older controllers is uh they used to have two gears basically sitting in the 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 the, the handles essentially. Um, and they would spin, and they just spin at different speeds. Um, then the later ones had uh, a bit more going on with it, where it was like multiple parts to it spinning. And uh, yeah, I, I think that like it would just be very violent at times. I don't know if there was too many times where I was like, oh, this is a really good um, vibration sense. Whereas this, this is all the way through the controller. This is completely different. I wish I could get a PS5. I really want Hogwarts Legacy. I'm so curious what the game will end up being. SSD Speedway. Oh, it is. Oh, it is a hard drive rack. Okay. So by the way, just so you know, see this little R? See this here? I can feel the difference in terms of like me walking over different terrains. So this is very soft. It's barely, barely vibrating. It gets a little bit more. And then when I work over this, I don't know if you, it's not catching up the, it's not picking up the audio from the controller, but it's, it's making little sharp noises, but it's also, it's vibrating a teeny weeny bit heavier. So, it just adds a sense of, like, terrain to the game. Oh, I got a thing. What's this? It tells me to do it with that. What, is, what do you want me to do? Okay. Oh, you throw it. <clears throat> so, apparently you can do this in different orders, too. Um, which, uh, like, so, you, like I said, this is kind of a showcase also, or, or a history of the consoles themselves as well. So like, um, we are currently on the PS5, but it'll go take us all the way back to the PlayStation 1. Um, so we get to pick a world. Cooling Springs. Rumble technology seems super interesting. Uh, that's the thing, is I think this is really interesting myself, but like, again, it's something hard to stress to you guys. Also, the game just looks really nice. Like, I wouldn't say that it's blowing me away in terms of its visuals. I think it looks really nice. Looks very, very new, new gen, but um, very clean, very, very high texture quality. How is it visually for you guys? Is is the is the capture good? Do you think that the visuals look good? Is it being choppy at all? It looks all right on my end, but it's hard to say because I'm capturing. I think it's 720p, and the game is definitely on 1080p on my end. Oh, that actually that texture looks really nice. Looks good. Okay, cool. Little oh, ball. If I spent 5k, can I have a sound command added? Uh, is that how much the sound command is? Like I said, sound commands are like, uh, this will be the last time that you can have sound commands put in at that price. I'm going to crank up the price soon. But yes, you definitely can kick here. If you have a sound command you want to add, then let's do it. Where do we want to go? What do you guys want to see? Do you want to see the original PlayStation? We've got an SSD area. We've got a CPU area, uh, a fan area. I don't know what that thing is at the back. Kind of just, it's nice. This is nice movement too. It feels nice as a platformer. What the hell is this thing? Huh. 
This feels, yeah, this just kind of just feels like a good platformer. Okay, I'm just going to scale this wall, apparently. Found something. So apparently this is a very easy game to platinum, by the way. So it seems short enough, and it seems to be very, like, friendly. If you want, if you were the type of person who really wants platinum trophies, you should play this game. Um... A couple of things I want to show off as well that I'm aware of that actually have integration in this game, but we'll do this for now. I'm going to see what this is. How do I... oh. Add Keanu Reeves saying breathtaking. I will totally do that, Kick here. I will totally add that. I love that. Thank you. I love that wholesome request. Do you memory... Do you... Do you memory for snow? What do you mean, Mumbin? As in, like, do I have a memory for, for going to the snow? Or do you mean Snow the character from Final, Fan from Final Fantasy XIII? My character in, um, 14 actually looks a lot like Snow. This is what I've done? What do, what do you mean, Prince? What have you done? Wholesome surprises? I know. <laughs> I'm, I'm just shocked by Wholesome again. That's how it's, the streams used to be, honestly. Until, until I started interacting with other other streamers and I lost control at a certain point oh cool everything I think that's all of that oh I wonder if you can can I can I how far can I glide not that far there's no fall damage do memory meadow memory meadow was this one this is SSD all right hang on where's memory meadow what was that one Ah, this one. All right. It's like it's actually like soap. It's like it looks like foam, but it's soap apparently. All right, let's go. You're breathtaking. Gusty gateway. Oh, whoops! I just attempted to capture. Okay. Oh, look. So this. Okay, so this is a thing now. So you know how I just got that trophy just before. It will show me the last few seconds before I got the trophy. Um, and this is actually important because um, there is a thing, if I know how to do it. Um, there is something in the menu stuff. If I click the PlayStation button, you can see here that there's these. Um, there's a achievement here, PC. Uh, got it. It'll show you how to complete achievements, which is completely new. I don't know how many games are going to integrate this in. But there's also like, um, apparently there's official news from other games. Um, I kind of don't like it being in the left hand side. I would actually prefer the highlighted one to be in the middle, but it kind of makes sense. Um, can I just go to the thing? So, okay, so here's the thing. So, find all artifacts in the level. So this is actually not something I recorded. I haven't even done the level yet. And I can watch this video. So the achievement is to go collect everything. And I can see that this person, this is how he completed the puzzle. But this is kind of spoilers in a sense, and that's kind of what's weird about it. Also, I've just noticed he's on a PSP. Um, but uh, yeah, it's funny because there's this situation. Also, the vo video quality actually bumped up for a second there. Um, it was actually like sub 720 for a second and then went up. I can punch the cats. Until you met me and Buns, pretty much. I mean, Buns is pretty wholesome. I'm not sure if I could say the same about you. I like that edition. I don't know if I like it or dislike it, and I don't know how far they're going to take it in terms of, like, is this something that we're going to see it a lot of? Oh, look! An old uh, controller connector. The PlayStation one. Yeah, so if, if you're a PlayStation fan and had every console, you probably will recognize lots of stuff. Can I destroy that man with the balloons? Do I have lasers? I got a little cape. I feel like these are meant to be something, but I don't know what those are. Might be just connectors. I got my loan paid and rent paid. Nice! Good work, Kick here. Being responsible. Oh, hang on. Can I fall through this cloud? Nope. It's kind of squishy. It's also more haptic stuff. I can feel it push me back up. Oh, well, people... Uh also do the same, but on YouTube. Wait, which part? 
I have a PS1, a PS2, and also a PS4 from the previous year. I, I've got all my consoles. I wish I had the original PS3. That's the one that I wish I had, but it was expensive, um, so I couldn't get it. It was like one of those things, I remember working at Target uh, when I was a teenager, which is like a... I guess... Also, this is this is another haptics thing, it's just, it's just making it vibrate. Um, I remember when I was working at one of those stores... Ow! Um, and... Uh, yeah, they, uh, I was saving up money, and I was, I remember working there, I was so really wanting to get a PS3, I was like, no, I have to save up, I can't do that, and a friend of mine grabbed it, and it was just like, damn, that's pretty good, the fact that you can play the older consoles was pretty amazing. Ah, uh, okay, so is that, so you'll notice this is that thing we saw before. Um, also, there's little skelly mans. Oh, there's mud! Wait, oh, wait, hang on. I think that might be a reference to what's-his-face, um, from, uh... What's it called? What's that game called? Evil? Medieval. I think it might be the guy from Medieval, maybe? Or it might be just a generic thing. So there's a whole heap of character references throughout this, by the way. My family had the PS3, but they, the, let's say my stepdad's, oh, that's, that's, that's right, you, I remember you telling me that kick here. I feel so bad for people who got the $600 and not for long cheaper and the model came out. So, but the thing is though, the reason why I wanted that model kick here, that original model, <laughs> he waved at the camera, very cute. Um, the reason why that model was really good was because it actually had backwards compatibility. Did I just get smushed? I got smushed from a weird angle. Am I dead? Wow, you, okay. You die very easily in this game. Oh, and it resets you back. Okay. Ape Escape? Wait, where was Ape Escape? I didn't see it. Where was the Ape Escape? Hey, Genki. Hey, Gang. I did. I did. I got very lucky. All in the mind. It's all in the mind. Bug snacks when I do actually have bug snacks. We might play a bit of it today. So today is going to be dedicated to completely to playing the PS5, just so you know. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm too poor right now. Yeah, that's fair enough. I just, that's kind of why I like showing this off in a sense, is so you guys can see it, so you can tell me like we can, you if you want to see anything in particular on the PS5, we can I can show it off. You live vicariously through me. We. There was an ape escape there? Where? Where? Where, where, where? I didn't see it. Was I blind? I'm kind of just exploring at this point. I will slow down and... at some point. I like that this is a nice touch. I like... I've talked about with like... I haven't actually probably talked about it too much. On Demon Souls... Oh, that's cute. Oh, he puts it back on. Um, on Demon Souls... not Demon Souls. On Digimon. Digimon have a, has a very much like a... like... I ran past it like five times. Don't worry, I'll go back. Don't worry, I will. I will go back. I, I promise. I'm currently just. I'm just kind of doing my own thing and talking at the same time. Um, so in Digimon, one of my favorite things is actually like. Oh look, that's a pretty modern reference. Um, uh, in Digimon, they have this big thing where like there's a lot of digital in terrain and things. Um, a lot of integrated stuff where it's like you're in a, you're essentially meant to be in a computer and uh i really 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 like that and oh no oh you just get hit and you're dead is that it oh crap okay so these are checkpoints those little things are checkpoints easy how do i defeat you oh i have a crabby's head There's little memory cards and things. Oh, it's an S. It's a little. Uh, what are they called? Is it, that's not an SSD? What are they called for cameras? SSD? PS1 cloud. Yeah. Yeah. The amount of references is going to be a little off the chain in this, so going to have to keep it up. I saw a Vita memory card. Oh, is that what it was? I always think of it as the, the little phone memory cards. We might have to go back because I feel like I've missed that area back there, so. Um, that's what we might do. Can I, can I make myself run faster? Do I have to run over these? Oh, he's got a little rain umbrella. I might not be able to go back. Oh no, I feel I can go back that way. Alright. 
Make a Palico wear this. I'm putting in DMs, DMs. The, I'm putting the ho in ho ho ho. Oh god. Prince, this is one of those things I'm going to regret. I wanted to make this like a very wholesome stream. Make it a good showcase. It is wholesome. I don't know. I don't know if I trust him. Quite a few different directions. Artifact. To Sony Mouse. Never had one of these. Very weird. Ooh, oh, the haptic. Oh, wow. Oh, that feels really nice. So the haptic, uh, the, the, the limiters on the R2 for the zoom and L2 kind of have like a nice like wind up. Oh, that feels really good. That was really cool. I don't know why I can't turn it around. Nice, it's got me a mouse. It's festive, trust Prince. I don't know if I do. Oh, you can destroy them. Oh my god. Astro has no remorse. Some big memory sticks. At, with a mouse is pretty sus? Nah. Cute, that's what it is. Um, if I can jump down there. We'll go down here. Oh, there we go. There's a PS1 controller. Ooh. I like the fidelity. That This actually looks almost photorealistic. That's actually really good. Extra quality is really quite nice on this. Wish I can control. Oh, 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 okay. That's how it does it. It's actually, it's motion controls. So it's actually me moving the controller. That makes sense. What is up with the controller port? Oh, it's because it's the, that's where the cable is. And they've just lopped off the cable. Oh, wait, what the heck? Hang on. Can I? Oh, dude. What? They've got a serial code and stuff on it. Oh my God. That's really cool. Wow. The crazy level of detail. Trust me, entirely with where I'm wearing. All right, hang on. I'm gonna see what uh, Prince has sent me. Oh, you haven't sent me it yet. Oh no, have you? Hang on, wrong, wrong Discord. I was looking at the wrong Discord. Oh God. I, I knew, I knew it. I knew it. I totally knew that's where this was going. The problem is, this is going to cover up most of me. I basically don't exist at this point. Just all picture. Where am I? You'll see your eyes, I guess. Oh, it's very small. How's that? Is that good? Muscly Santa, that's what I am to you all. <laughs> Actually kind of works. I'm shocked how well this has worked. All right. <laughs> it's festive. You gonna go to a look? No problem. Why is this one red down here? Am I meant to be interacting with these things or is this just straight up checkpoints I've missed? Can I get up there? I wonder if you can... Nah. Right, let's keep moving. Oh wait, we wanted to see the, the super monkey. Okay, I can run up here. Where, do, where was Ape Escape? There's mud. Oh, here! Oh, I didn't even notice it. Here we are. Here's Ape Escape. That's pretty cool. Okay. Okay, some of the textures work is really nice in this actually. So I remember watching Giant Bomb's little bit on this. They were actually talking about how the skyboxes are actually in reference as well, but I don't recognize this particularly one, particularly this one. Wait, are these, oh, hang on. These might be multiple different controllers. Oh, it's more than one thing. The original PlayStation. Yeah, so if you're a big old PlayStation nerd, this is, this is very good for you. I might play this through, like, 
I wasn't ex wanting to play all of this, but I actually kind of really like this. I don't understand why people amp this up, this game up. It's just a nice little platformer. I feel like those guys are going to get scary later, because they might have spikes. Boink! Oh, look. <laughs> the Origami Killer! But yeah, some of the refer some of these are meant to be pretty obscure references at times, so. I don't know how to kill this one. Wait, it's telling me to Oh, okay. We just laser him in the head. The rain The raindrops are the controller symbols? No. Really? Can I zoom in? Is there a way for me to zoom in, pink guy? On the floor. Oh, on the floor. Okay. Oh, they are too! Shit! Wow, they went all out on this. This is a weird bird. Wait, what is that bird meant to be? Is that bird meant to be something? I don't know what that bird is. Oh. Waiting for Cooler World. Oh my god, Cooler World! I would love a Cooler World reference, CJ. I doubt that would ever happen. It's so retro and so unknown. That would never happen. Heart, a Heart of Darkness reference. That bird feels familiar. I don't know what that bird was. I thought it might have been, um, uh, whatchamacallit. Also, the ice feels really cool. I, don't, I really don't know what that bird is. There's probably some big old breakdown of, like, all the different ones. I don't know if these, these little guys can really hurt me. pretty fair. I mean, it's pretty easy on the player. I feel like that it's not too difficult in terms of attacking the enemy and stuff. Nice. Oh, I kind of, I like, it, it changed, actually changed when my umbrella went away and now I'm just being hit on the body. It has a different feel. I don't think I'm going to be able to collect all those coins. Memory Meadows, Fast Lane Fields. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, they're all... Oh, okay. So there's the fan one, so we can just go from any area in the world. Network speedrun? Huh. I kind of want to go to the one that's like... I want to go to one that's like it's as retro as I can make it. What the fuck is this? Oh, I had to zip him up. <laughs> All right, I'm a ball now. Oh my god, are we super monkey ball now? Oh, okay. So I have to, I have to keep flicking it. Oh, okay. So I've got to flick the ball in the direction I want to go, which isn't the easiest thing to control in on on the in the earth. Oh, okay. Oh no, I don't want to go forward. I actually don't want to go forward. I need to go back. Ah, oh, nuts. Ooh, that feels cool. We can teleport at any time, so I think I'm okay. There's a little rabbit fella. Is the rabbit a reference? Or the carrot a reference? Okay. Alright. <laughs> this is really cool. I feel like, it, you want to talk about Cooler World? This is basically like Cooler World. Uh, <laughs> CJ at this point. Kind of Super Monkey Ball, yeah. Um, Jazz, ja Jazz Jackrabbit? Jazz Jackrabbit was a PC game, wasn't it? I don't think it's a PlayStation game. Can you look inside and see that? No, you can't, okay. It's kind of awkward to rotate. Yeah, right? We're getting a lot of PlayStation 1 stuff. I wonder if it does PlayStation 1 and then does like PS2 later. Oh. 
Maybe those arrows don't matter. Maybe I can just go back. Wait, hang on. Can I... I thought I could almost do the, the quick dash from, um... Whee! From, um... Katamari. Uh-oh. That's something I'm not a big fan of, is the checkpointing not collecting stuff. Like, I'd rather just be checkpointed put back, but... I have to get enough speed. Oh, I can stop on a dime. Guys, I can stop on a dime. Oh, look at that. This feels really good. <laughs> it's so weird, because it's like, not only does the game... Oh, look. The Astro Bot came. Wait, hang on. Astro Bot? What? No. That's not real. This isn't a real game. It's a PlayStation 1 disc for a game called Astro Bot that doesn't exist. You can't lie to me, game. I know that's not real. Um... Oh, cool. Can I jump? What's that? Oh, do you know what that is? It's the CD player, look. Oh, that's super cool. So if you didn't know, the original PlayStation, one of the big reasons why people got super excited about it was, unlike the N64, the P PlayStation had a CD drive, um, so to play games, but it was also a, just a CD drive in general. Um, oh, I missed. Do I really care about the coins? I don't know if I really care about the coins. Um, but yes, uh, whoa! um, gimme, gimme, chicken tendies, be they crispy, hey, Rainbow, Wendy's, hey, guys, spend my hard earned good boy points on kids' meal ball pit burger joints. Uh, Rainbow, you actually missed, was it yesterday or the day before? I was, I played, um, What Remains of Edith Finch, and I was totally like wondering if you would be able to appear because it was like, I thought that would be the type of game you would enjoy. Oh, okay, so it kind of locked me in there. Oh no, there's a puzzle piece. Oh uh, no. What's this? Go, okay, we're going to space now. Are we in a new area? Yeah, there we go. Okay, new area. That's a great game. You have played it? I thought you would like that one. Unfortunately, my computer was having a bit of a sook about it, but uh, I still have fun. Fuck you. Having fun in the air without me? You can't do that. You want to see me zipped up? Someone put my dress on for me. Zip me up. Chat, zip me up. What are you doing? And I'm wiggling my tush for you. You don't like this? There are a lot of moments that game I absolutely adore. Yeah, um, I was with, um, I was playing it and, uh, Brookie was there. And Brookie was just telling me about how much she absolutely loved that game. Alright, I wanted to explore this area because I didn't really fully explore it. Eh, go back. What was that? And it's just for, uh, baseball. Apparently baseball is a thing. Rabbits from Mario. Doki doki doki! I'm actually trying to control it with both thumbs. As if you're like wheeling it up. It's kind of. I'm trying to play it kind of like Katamari, I guess, is how I would describe it. Yeah, a lot of moments I do on that game. I, I, I think, I think I enjoyed that game. I kind of wish, I don't know. I think I, I didn't get. I wonder whether or not I would have been better for me not to stream that game, but it was, it was still a fun experience. Yeah, the framework was a little choppy. I did have to lower the detail. I think the design work in that game was absolutely amazing. All right, we're gonna try and get through this as fast as we can because I want that one puzzle piece. Oh, so if you recollect. Can I light these all up? No, we can't. Okay. I really like... Going over these feels really fun. There's just a lot of little, like, tactile, like, interactions. Like, it's weird to say, but they've now developed a controller that tactile feels 
good. Like, this feels like something I would, could see myself, like, having an experience with a game where it's like, oh, I, that's a nice feeling thing. Like, you pick up an object in a game, I'm like, oh, this is, this feels nice to, like, touch or whatever. I wonder what these coins are for. Alright, let's try and go... Uh, I want to try and get that puzzle piece on the right-hand side. Oh, So we want to be on this side. Uh, wait till you see what it's like in Demon Souls? I am curious. I really don't know what, how it feels in Demon Souls. Um... But so far, this feels really good. Um, again, I don't know how long I'll play this for because I kind of... I feel like this game's a good showcase, but it's like one of those things like, do I play this all the way through, which is about three hours, or do I alternate different games? Because it's currently... I've got like three hours to go, so... Play it all the way? You want to see me play this all the way through, you reckon? Ooh, there's a little plane. I don't know which playing game that is. Game is fun. If you guys are enjoying watching it, I'm totally down to play it. The Big Bird was a reference to The Last Guardian. It was a Last Guardian reference. I was wondering if it was, but... I just didn't look like the Griffin, so I didn't think it was. Rico? Jumping Flash was the big rabbit. What is Jumping Flash? Oop. Got kind of sucked in the cloud. Wait, is that Ghost of Tsushima? Have we already got a Ghost of Tsushima reference? How? That's really modern. There's some modern references here! Save me! That was Ghosts? PS1 Robot Rabbit game? I totally don't know what that is. I that I have to get stuff back. It's kind of annoying that I have to do that. I hope this is not progress. It's hard to tell what's progress in this game, actually. Or what's extra areas. Oh my god! <laughs> This is not something I thought I would see. It's the, it's the TV attachment to uh, the PS1. I like that it's also, you can tell from up the top there, you can see it's got the, the later PS1 logo. On the back. Got the standard stuff to like as if you're covering up the disc. Cool. I feel like tech nerds must be like super in, in love with this. Uh, the level of detail in this is just fucking crazy. You'll know it when you see the cover, maybe? Oh, probably. Oh, hello. That actually spooked me. Alright, I didn't have to control that. I was worried I'd have to control that thing while blowing. Give it a bit of a blow. This. Um... Wasn't it only for a small PS1 anyway? Well, the thing is, that it might have like in like weird indie references throughout this. I don't know if I can I kill these. Do I want to kill these? Oh no, I didn't get all the things. All right, I don't think I want to kill these. What do the puzzle pieces do? I don't even know. Now the TV plug on it, I thought it was, oh, for the small piece. Oh, maybe. That might make sense. They're recording something. Wait, is, oh, it's a, uh, uh, shoot. What is the name of that game? I didn't play it. It was, uh, the man with superpowers. He had like plasma powers, electricity plasma powers. Infamous? <gasps> wow, you tricked me, game.
we go. Is it the same lightning every single time? Okay, cool. Alright. I might have to do half at a time. Laser boots, that's right. We have little laser boots. Hey Dusk, hey going. I missed one. I'm gonna do this. This, by the way, this 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 game just feels really good. It just feels really good, even just as a tech demo. Now I understand why people were just so like it has good platforming feel. Oops. Oh no, I jumped too early. You're hiding it, trying out a harder difficulty in Diablo Three. Nice. Are you doing like a as in your one of your first playthroughs, or are you doing um? What are, what should I call? I can't even remember the names of the runs in that game. Actually, when you increase the, okay, that's the only thing so far that's gotten me twice that I kind of don't think is very fair. The hit test on that's kind of a bit weird. Coming back from my old saves, I, I still, it's super weird to me because I, I did, um, before they nerfed the shit out of the game, I played a lot of, um, oh, you're kidding me. I played a lot of, um, Diablo when it first came out and I did it on the hardest difficulty as a barbarian, which is one of the harder things to do. And then they nerfed the shit out of it and then it just became like end game is mostly about tier gear collecting and stuff, which I'm fine with. That's fun in itself, but it was like. It was very different to what I would had been doing previously. I got a, a bow user who spams arrows each time he walks. Oh, nice. Some of the builds are fucking crazy. It is funny, though, because a lot of it is based around, um, thingy now. Yeah. What is this? It's a ghost Japanesey game? I don't know even know what this is. Can we turn off the storm? Siren. It's a PS2 horror game. Huh. Oh look, it's the Elba! The multi-tab. Okay, so just so you know, in the original piece well, PS1, you can only have one controller plugged in at any given time. Um, so and uh, no, not one, two controllers. So you can only do two player multiplayer. Whereas the, uh, the Nintendo 64 had four controllers you could plug in. Um, there weren't many games that actually required you more than two players. So what you would do is you would plug in this. Oh, this is, yeah, it is this. You would plug this in instead of one of your controllers and it would expand it so you could have four controllers. Um, Byron, you love Siren? It was so hard. I'd never even heard of it, I'll be honest. So I was talking about references. There's going to be a lot of crazy, crazy references here that I'm not going to know. What? They have one for the PS2 as well. Did they? They probably did. I, I, I never got one for the PS2. I had one for the PS1, but then realized most games don't function with it. So I just didn't care too much. Can that actually hurt me? I don't actually know if that can hurt me. I like that these things have spikes. Oh, it's an actual TV. Can I get on top of the TV? I can. Oh, there's a thing on top of you. <laughs> this game is very charming. This game is cute. Hey, Tante. That's literally what I just said. You stole my thing. You can't say that, Tante. I said that. Uh, this is coming back to my... Uh. Have to keep moving. Oh god! It's Robo God. Hi Robot God. Uh please be merciful. Oh, there we go. Oh. From my perspective I said it first. Nah. It's all about my perspective, Tante. You have to realize that about streaming. Um 
Also, coming back from my modded Terraria saves and had a lot of fun killing things. I love Terraria. I would probably wouldn't play it on stream because it's, it's very dive consuming, but it's very fun. Uh, Doko Demo Isoi um, Pocket PlayStation. Oh, I need to look at what's happening. I'm actually, I'm now in a, pinb I'm in a pinball machine, so I'm going to have to pay attention a little bit. Maybe? Nah, not really. We good. Um... Uh, is the Pocket PlayStation reference coming up soon? I had no idea what... What is it called? Doko Demu Isio. I don't even know what that is. I want to get... I want to get all the pinballs. This do. Oh, yeah! So, one of my projects I actually did in university, um, was actually... I made a... Not a functioning, uh, pinball machine. But I, uh, I probably could have. It wouldn't have been too hard actually taking the model I made because I actually made a, a, like a, all the pinball components and put it together in a 3D space. It looked pretty good, and the like physics for something like that wouldn't actually been too bad to set up. But yeah, pretty fun. I made 3D space pinball. That's right. Don't tell anyone I know that I did. Can we go into that? Or are these just... Oh, it's just where those things came out, I guess. Whee! I will say, this is probably the part I don't really want to do as much. I really hope I got checkpointed there. I did. Good. Um, I kind of just want to do the platforming. Uh, uh. Gotta go back. Gotta go back, Marty. Oh, we can, we can stop on the ice. That's interesting. The dangerous path. This is like a. This is for pros only. Pro gamers only now. Gamers, this is just for you. This is very slippery. Save me, gamers, please. Help me. Come here. I would love to see like people might speed run this game. By the way, I've already seen speed runs, and it, they're fucking crazy. This is the upgraded uh, dual stock, isn't it? I think it's still the PlayStation 1 controller, and I think it's the DualShock. <sighs> Much better PS1 controller, yeah. This is, I had... Most of the ones I had as uh, extras uh, were those ones. I think... Oh god, the, the tactile of this game just feels really nice. I can't... I really... Ah, fuck! Can't stress that enough. This game gives off a Galaxy 2 vibe. Kind of does, actually. Got a really good... Yeah, I saw that coming. <laughs> this gives off, like, it's... It's just got really good platforming feel, like, overall. Fuck. Alright, maybe I need to start using... Thingy. Mandatory for AQ Escape? Yes. There was quite a few games where it was actually kind of mandatory. Alright, so that literally stops all your momentum, so... I will say pinball is very satisfying when it's like that. Oh, uh, what are these called? V mods? What were these called? I can't even remember. Have a sip of water. Thank you, Kick here. You stuck in Castle Crashers? Okay, uh, Castle Crashers were like very much like you. You kind of have to go and level sometimes. You might have to go back and level. Interact. Wait, there's an interact button. Oh, well, oh, you can open it up. The pocket station. B mod was the Dreamcast one? Yeah, you might be right. Yeah, so I never had one of these. Or did I? Did I have one? I don't think I have one. Because I remember there was something you could do with like Digimon and stuff and I wanted to get one. And I don't think I did because there was not really many that you really interacted with these things. Um, but yeah, they're like tiny, tiny little game things. No, these were only in Japan only. Ah, that's why I said Japan. Big inside Japan. Yeah, I think I'd seen them. I think they might have been outside of Japan, but I don't think I ever saw them. Um, uh, or I didn't know anyone with them. No! Oh, please don't make me do that entire thing again. 
Okay, good. Thank God. What are these coins are for? And back, uh, back when video games were black and white, yeah. Why have a feeling that you you never got to experience that dusk? That was my life. Original Game Boy. What are you wearing? I don't know. Prince came by again. If you ever, if you ever have the question of what are you wearing, maybe take a guess who's been by. Oh, oh, I know that sound. Oh. Uh, uh, yeah. Oh my God, this is so nostalgic. I love this. That's the PlayStation 1. We're actually in the little boot logo thing. Um, that's cool. All right, can't, can't interact with that. That's cool. Oh my god, my childhood in a sound, I know. What the fuck is this? Oh, these are those cats. Oh. These are those cats that were from like, um, promo stuff, weren't they? That's a weird pool. Can I interact with this thing? I guess I can't. Fuck, this kind of looks cool. I kind of... Alright, so... Cyberpunk. Want to talk cyberpunk? To me, this, in a sense, is a part of cyberpunk aesthetic. Uh, just a collection of crap and like old monitors, just computer tech, just all of it slapped together. People talking about back in the day like they were alive for it. <laughs> yeah, no one could be alive for that. I don't have the muns back in the day, so you couldn't afford it. That's fair enough, Dusk. Well before games were black and white, they were green and black. That's true, a lot of them were green and black um, because it was just a better way to represent color and the... Uh, I don't even know what they... I, I think it was the the types of crystal screens they used. It was more cost-effective to make green and black. What's this? Bot Racer. I want to play. Let me play. Ridge Racer! <laughs> Is it meant to be a Ridge Racer reference? I was going to say that, but I didn't think it was. There's a Doko Do- Oh, that's Doko Demo Isio. Oh, yes. So it was them. Okay. So I kind of do know about that, CJ. I didn't realize that's what they were called. Um, yes. I'm vaguely aware of them. Armin was just here. Armin, you're still here. What are you talking about? Ooh, that feels nice. I like that. The original PlayStation. Yay! So is it like an hour per, like... Feels like almost an hour per like area and uh, console. Man, I'm just gonna nerd out to this. Fuck it, we're just gonna play this game now. <laughs> I'm just enjoying this. Kind of weird interacting like this. I've, I, I, the control is currently like back to front. Just by the way, guys. There you go. Is your cereal anything close to that, guys? But yeah, this is this is the OG PlayStation. And it's the original too, it's not the lights. I wonder if they have the other versions of the PlayStation, because there was like three different versions of the PlayStation 1. Yeah. The level of detail? Yeah, it's crazy. See that little... Okay, so do you want to know what's funny about this? See that little lens there? If that little lens ever got scratched or anything, you were stuffed. You could not play your PlayStation games. PlayStation games were probably one of the more finicky of the consoles, just because of the fact that, like, it was... All of it was reliant on an old... Uh, CD read laser, which holy shit. You love the PS1 mini though? I never had one, so I don't know. Thick station, not as thick as some of the later ones we'll see, Tante. If they have the original PS3 in here, we will know what a thick station is. You thought it was Wave Racer? It might be Wave Racer, I'm not really sure. I pulled it off the desk and smashed the CD reader. Shit, I was literally just talking about how the CD reader is like, was very like fragile. Ah, we're collecting them all. There we go. That's cool. Damn it, people. Why are you not rubbing Daimono? He's raw. Till he's raw. No, save me. Oh, okay. That's cool. PlayStation Labo? Wait, hang on. The Labo? What? That's that's a Nintendo thing. You can't say that. Oh, look. Oh, shit. It's uh, Colin McRae, I think. I think that dinosaur is meant to be something, but I don't know what that is. Spyro! 
I actually have Spire. We could play Spire. Play lots of different things. Can I break these? Yeah. Screw your boxes. Labo? Yeah, it's a different Labo. We're in a different Labo right now. I fucked my PS1 lens. It was mostly okay. The circle and the disc would... Oh my gosh, CJ. I feel like you missed one. That's okay. It's... It will... I might return to this. I might 100% this. This might be a game that I might actually want to 100% because the nostalgia is super fucking intense for this. Like, this is this is making me excited to think about, like, all the different things. Things I didn't see. Things I did have. Like, pretty cool. Hello. Who are you? What is this? <gasps> Gatchapon! Shit, yeah. Do you want to know where the term gacha comes from? Here we go. Got a cranky crank. Oh, here we go. So this is how you get the extra puzzle pieces. Okay. Oh, so it's like reference to the trophies. Cool. Play Dark Cloud or a Ratchet and Clank game? Oh, oh yeah. Strong robo arm. Fuck you. Oh, look. Sackboy. Why is Sackboy getting like... Hang on, what? Wait. Well, they all have little like serial numbers and stuff. That's cool. How are you controlling the arm? So I this is motion controls. On the left hand side is on the right hand side is motion controls. Left hand is just me pulling the crank. And it, I can feel the tension. So it's like there's no tension, 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 and then it clicks over. <laughs> Game's a bit of a joy. Not gonna lie. Can I hit the boy? Oh, yeah, I can turn it right around. <laughs> Ugh. What's this? Oh, oh, okay. This is where you get additional artifacts. What is this? Wait. Oh, it's the, it's the thing so you can play online. It's actually the little modem connector. What the hell? <laughs> I, I, I didn't actually have one of these. I never played any PlayStation 2 games online because I never had this. Um, that's pretty fucking cool. This is this is what I was talking about because now I get to see things I never saw. Interesting. You had that? I feel I kind of wish I'd gotten stuff like that because I feel like I kind of missed out. Look, look at the number we've got, guys. Yeah, internet number. Demo one disc. Uh, demo PS one demo disc. T tech demo T Rex. Is that what that was? Watch out, it costs 100 coins per cool. Well, at least it's not real money. We could, we could do whatever we want. We can use as much as we want on this thing. I think this is just pretty much, it's like the, it's like, it's like Smash. This is just like collecting things. I only don't really, I really kind of don't care about like the Astro little thingies so much. I kind of care more about the, uh, these. Oh, here we go. This is what I was talking about. So this is the PlayStation 1. We can open it up. There we go. This is this. The third version of the PS1? This looks like the third version to me. The cute station? It's very, it's very round, isn't it? Secret number? Secret numbers. You had it for Final Fantasy uh, 11? Oh, Final Fantasy 11. Yes. Was that on PS2? I thought it was PS... No, yeah, you're right. Holy shit, you're right, Prince. Internet number. When it became the PS1 officially? Basically, yeah. Yeah, because it was just the PlayStation at that point. Which means, I wonder if that means that they were started working on the PS2 by that time. Or was the PS2 out at that point? I really don't know. What's this? Oh, it's a PSP. The PSP doesn't get its own area, I guess. The Vita and the PSP probably will not get their own area. Look at this sexy console. I really did wish I'd like I had owned one of these. They're very cool. This was the was this the one that could be a phone? Correct me if I'm wrong. That was the digital only PSP. Ah. Chicka chicka chicka. The PS2 was out. Ah, that makes sense. If it that yeah, otherwise it wouldn't really make sense. So this is a PSP Go. 
I'm fairly sure the PS1 only had two models, big and small, and there were some changes in the ports in the back. I thought there was like three. I thought there was like a, that rounded one we saw as well. Because it was a lighter weight one. You got the OG PSP. I want to see if we can, I can find it. Gotta go have a shower, probably head to the road. No problem, Tanti. Thank you for the host also. You have a great day, man. Enjoy shower, enjoy day. Nope, there was a phone that was like this. Oh, okay, okay, I understand. Strong robo -arb. However, it needs repairs. I feel like a lot of those old things now, like as much as you looked after them, probably will need to be looked after. Is this the, PS, is this the PS2's camera? It is too. PSP camera? What? I didn't even know the PSP could have a camera adapter. Huh. 1.3 megapixels. Look how shiny this is. Was it just chrome? Was it chrome like this? This is so shiny. Not PS2, PST? Yeah, I, I thought the, the P there was the two. It was the PS2 was the iCam. Yeah, that's right. Because I thought I remember it being black. PS1 was smaller and was released. A PS1 smaller was released in 2000. Uh, I think you're getting confused with the uh, the hit system, the N gauge. Maybe, maybe CJ. The last one we can get. And it's PSVR, so it's at least something. It's like PlayStation VR when it came out. A friend of mine had that, and we like uh, when we lived together, and it was fucking, it was fun as. I actually, I really actually. Like a lot of the games showcases in that. Um, not the VR, the, sorry, the the Move. We did have the PSVR though. Uh, so this is this gets all the puzzle pieces I'm missing, I guess. Wait, what is that? I was just showing off stuff. The N-Gage had a vertical screen, it was ahead of its time. Vertical viewing in games were very co are very common now, that's true. Making blocks with some CPU parts. Oh, there's the Sackboy. Oh, these are the things we were collecting. Oh, they actually have physical presence. Wait, so everything has physical presence? Huh. We should go have a look at that picture that we made. I actually want to see it better. They're very cute. This is just a very cute game. Can I break these? Yeah, the PlayStation Store. Oh, and here's the trophies. You got a trophy? I got a trophy for getting a trophy. <laughs> That's very clever. Yeah, so what so this is this one. So this oh, so this is the celebratory one. Okay. There's like a few things there that I feel like... I oh know we pretty much have everything that's there. That's cool. Is there gameplay in this game? There is infinite. I mean, there's platforming, but we haven't uh, we haven't gotten to it yet. Oh my god. Lizard Planet. Thank you for the the, uh, the raid. How are you going today? DJ, would you give uh, Lizard a uh, shout out for me, please? Thank you. What were you doing today? You were playing Apex. Nice, man. Did you get any... Did you get any Predator wins? How are you liking the new uh, Christmas map? Or the Christmas event? <laughs> Alright, I feel like I feel like at this point we should probably go and do a level. Because <laughs> uh, if it's right, we haven't looked at a level for a little while. Um, how, do I, how do I get back to levels? Is a good question. Do I go from here? I guess I go from here. We did this entire area, so we can go do another one. Can I do this? Or we have to go back to the plaza? <clears throat> Need more coins? We're definitely gonna get more coins. I think we might just play through this game. I'm now I'm now just having a nostalgia kick. It's like turned into me showing off like the, the PlayStation. Uh on a roll. New speedrun challenges are available. Oh okay. So apparently the speedruns are different. They're not actually just the levels. Apparently they're additional versions of maps and stuff like that. Which I don't know if we'll do. You hear from Lizard? Welcome! Uh no see way. Oh, no? <laughs> Apologies if I butchered your name. How are you doing today? Which one do you guys want to see now? We want to go... So that... Oh, okay. So that was where... Is this where we came from? Is this... Is this the... Ah, uh, uh, this is the Labo. So this is where we came from. So... 
Uh, and from memory. Do you want to see? Do you want to see a fan? Oh, thank you for the follow. Also, uh, cooling springs. GPU jungle. Oh, it's GPU jungle, not CPU. That makes sense. Uh, or SSD speedway. Look at this one. Look at this edgy black and red. This is the gamers colors. Which one do you say is gamers colors? Black and red? Black and green. Black is definitely going to be in there. GPU jungle. Real gamers. Going to get that monster energy. Cooling area. I'm very keen to play this in like two years when I get a PS5. RGB. Which one was the RGB? GPU? Alright, we'll go GPU. <laughs> oh, that was, that's rough on the eyes. What is this? Honeycombs? Honeycombs, I mean pine cones. Yes. Uh, if you hadn't seen the game, welcome to the stream. Um, uh, this is just really a showcase of the PlayStation 5 with its haptic feedback. So there's a lot of stuff I'm getting that I will be describing what's happening. But uh, really, it's mostly a platformer. Like, it's just a platform with a lot of nostalgia around it, which has been really fun. Like, I feel like there's a lot of people I wonder whether or not they're younger who got the PlayStation 5 and it's just sort of like, oh yeah, it's a thing that's happening. It's got retro shit, I guess. Probably a lot of people that don't really care about this. Oh my god! Oh, and they're playing it on the PSP too! Oh, that's so cool! So you ever want to know why I haven't played a lot of the portable versions of uh, Monster Hunter? Because they were on the PSP and the Vita. <laughs> so... Welcome to Monster Hunter. They really out the here gaming. That's what you do. That that's what they do in those ads. Infinite. Haven't you seen those ads about portable game stations? You play them outside with your friends while you instead of doing like outdoor activities. Oh, it's Crash! Wow, it's actually a little weird version of Crash. Wumper berries, wumper fruit. We have to play new Crash. People have said it's really good. So Monster Hunter reference soon. That was the Monster Hunter reference. CJ's keeping ahead. Oh look, there's a alloy, Horizon Zero. There's a pixel drag, a pixel dinosaur. Is that from 8-bit hero? Or 16-bit hero, whatever the game was called? Secret game. Man, the cringy ads. Oh, did you guys get ads? So I was actually talking to my girlfriend about it. Like, um, I wonder whether or not I can actually do anything to make it so you guys have less ads again. I Originally when I set it up, I didn't think I could. So this is the move controller. This is the original move controller too, isn't it? And you can have different colors. So this is what I was talking about before. Not before PSVR, they just had the move with the camera. So wait, hang on. This means, are we in a PS3 world? Oh, we didn't do it in order. <gasps> Alucard! <laughs> What's this thing? Is this a thing? I can't tell if that's a thing. <clears throat> 3D.hero? 3D.hero. Is it 3D.hero? It looks kind of like it. Whoa, he's gone. He's dead now. He's back. Breakable wall? I don't know, was it a breakable wall, Pinko? Should I go back and try? I could try, I don't know if it was. In the back of the cave? Breakable wall? Oh, here. Oh, what? What is this? Look at the light, it falls just right. My shadows, they please, beneath the trees. But none of these things happen for free. Yeah, all that you see, rendered by me. I synthesize and rasterize, immerse and immaterialize things that I fabricate for you, for you. I tessellate and animate these dancing sprites and sunlit skies for you. I do it for you. I'm your GPU, GPU. Tell me what to do and I'll do it for you. <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh, that, that thing's the thing I blew back, I just realized. That's really bizarre. Does this do anything? 
It's just a poem about a GPU. That's really funny. Have they just got weird poems throughout the, the game? Kingdom Hearts and uh, 2 were on the PS, uh, PS2. Yeah, I think this is the PS3 now, so we'll probably see PS3 references. So somehow we've gone out of order. Do we want to do them in order? Do the PS2 next? Or do we want to, do we want to stop here for this world, go back and do the PS2 world first? I play Oss when? I don't know what happened. I haven't played Oss in God knows how long. I'm surprised people put, still play it. It's quite old now. There's PS4 references to here. Oh, is there? Oh, you're... Look. Bloodborne. You're totally right. Oh, these honeycomb... Uh, honeycombs. Pine cones have a face as well. How do I get up here? We had PS3 references in the PS1 area. Oh, that's true. We might be okay. All right, let's just proceed. I feel like this this feels like we might be in a PS3 area, though. Whoa. Oh, okay. Little discs. If we get an artifact and it's a PS3 artifact, then maybe I might swap. Oh wait, we did. We got to move one, so I think we might be in the PS3 generation. I'll get to a checkpoint first, though. I reckon we might get a Kingdom Hearts reference, because they were on the PlayStation only for the longest time. This. What is this? Oh, it's Last of Us. I was like, Mushroom Zombie? Spam side to turn up the music. Do you want me to turn it up? How is the volume? Do you guys want it up a bit louder? I can turn it up a little bit uh, uh, louder for you guys. What is this? It looks like I can gather from any range. It's not like I can stuff that up. There's a Patapon reference here too. Oh, oh, I'm actually, I didn't realize I was standing on something. Missed a few coins, but that's okay. Anything else up there? That's it. <clears throat> it's very pretty, this game. This is where I talk about where it's like art style. Oh, okay. Can I grab this back here? Um, art style allows you, even though a game can look good for its generation, like this, this game looks good. It's still one of those things where it's like, um, this art style will allow this game to survive for a long time, I think. Really, it's just the resolution um, and model fidelity would be the only thing that people would really take notice of. And even then, I don't think you would really care too much. What's this? Climbing? What? What is that a reference to? It's Uncharted? I'm guessing this is Uncharted. The volume is fine, the song is just a bop. I don't know if I can turn it up, uh, infinite, actually. This is pretty quiet for me as well. These are very Mario-style enemies, I'll be honest. Can I... yeah, I can. What's this? I don't know what this is. Is this Patapon? I don't really know Patapon that well. Pat -pat 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 <laughs> ah! That was fun. I was still coming. Can I just... Uh, don't do that. I'm dead. Ah! Welcome back, Rainbow. We're, we're running away from this thing. I don't even know what that is. Do you guys know what that was? It's just a big cylinder to me, but I don't know what that is. Days Gone and Legacy of Kane references soon? Okay, cool. Try not to get too hard, far ahead, CJ, because I kind of want to see them uh, for myself, see what they are. And then if I don't get it. Like 
<laughs> Thanks, uh, Armin. Artifact. By the way, I don't know what this is. Is it? It's just a Vita cartridge. Oh, it's just a Vita cartridge. Oh, it's tear away. It's meant to be tear away. <laughs> Oh, I've got another poem. You've never wondered why. I catch your eye. It's cause you overlook all the choices I took. I spend all my time deceiving and misleading you. I like to surprise with all my virtual lies. I synthesize and rasterize and materialize things that I fabricate for you. For you. Yes, I tessellate and animate those dancing sprites. Okay. So there's a series of poems in this stage that I don't know if it's like going to make me do something. Oh God. Oh, monkey. Wait, what? Sit me up. I'm now a monkey. Please adopt me. God. Pretty, pretty. You got pretty. There was a tearaway reference before we saw the dude with the envelope head. Oh, that was a tearaway reference? I never played tearaway. I kind of wanted to. Huh? What? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. So I actually have to tilt the controller up. Interesting. So I have to... Huh. Okay, it's like I'm actually kind of climbing. <laughs> this is not what I was expecting. I actually have to tilt the controller left and right to get this. What's this? <laughs> it's kind of fun. Holy shit, this is just grip? What is grip? Uh... Oh. Ah! I almost fell off there. Ah. At least this seems to be pretty lenient if I stuff up. So what's what's grip? Is this another game? There's a game by Bennett Foddy where he did quap and getting over it. Oh really? So he, he this was a game similar to a game he did. Was it a PlayStation game? Oh, hang on. Hang on. Hang on. I moved it. I didn't mean to move it. Oh, that feel- oh wow, the tension when- so when I came back down- oh hang on, can I go? Uh-oh. I have to very lightly grab on. Oh my gosh. Got it. What is this? Oh, this is the iToy for the PlayStation 3? Looks really weird. I don't remember it being cubes. Was it cubes? I don't remember this. Let's say come as the model ID. <laughs> We. Uh, I don't want to drop down because I want that. The monkey, that monkey noise is straight up the monkey from Mario 64, by the way. Oh, that tension when, when it bounces, that feels really good, by the way. What the hell is this? Eh. Eh. Got it. PS3 controller. This should look familiar to a lot of people. We're now in the modern age, so this is going to be a lot more like... Stuff that I feel like more people will recognize. 
Look, they got no cereal on this one. There's no, there's no cereal sticker. It's only what's printed on. Still a good controller. Wait, hang on. Isn't this the PS4 one? Because I just realized it's got... Oh, yeah. It's the PS4 one because it's got the touchpad. Wait, hang on. Is this the PS4? Maybe we're doing the PS4. Fake gamer. Look, there's a lot of history, all right? Local streamer dies in local in rock climbing accident. I'm waiting for it. The I was like, it felt like it too familiar, and it looked really good. Did it? We're no longer monkey mode. That was fun. GPU jungle race trace ruins. Guess I can't go back up there. <laughs> we missed Legacy of Cain. Oh, did we? Oh, I didn't see it. That's the thing, it's like, I'm going, because we might play this whole thing, I'm kind of going at a brisk pace, like, I'm not... Oh look, God's back up there. Hey God. Uh... I'm going at a speed that's like, I think... And to see most of the stuff, at least. Shadow of the Colossus? Oh, it was too! Oh, look at that, that's pretty cool. Just because they use the same robot? I it confused the shit out of me. What's this? What is this? PSVR processor unit. What? Huh. That was the PS4 camera we saw? Oh, this is probably why I don't recognize these. Because these are PS4 additional things. I don't have a lot of additional things for the PS4. You gotta play Shadow of the Colossus sometime? You do. Go play the remake. Um I, the remake is really, really, really good. I love the original, but the remake is very, very good and looks very, very nice. The re is bananas? Bananas a reference? A bananas a reference? What's this? I don't know what this is. The dude with a gun. What does dude with gun mean? Cool. Order 1866. Oh, it's that game. I didn't play that game. Uh, leave me alone. That's pretty cool. It's probably I shouldn't I shouldn't jump to them. I should just let them come to me. Wait, I have a bow. Whoa! What? No! No way! Now we're doing bow stuff? Okay, cool. Alright. So this is- this isn't anything too crazy. This is just- The one thing I will say is that there is kind of some tension on the- when I pull back the string. I actually kind of wish that- It's on the L shoulder. Oh no, I can do it on both shoulders. Okay. I like R. I like R2 better. For shooting. So you can use R2, L2 here. Uh, oh. Can I shoot that thing over there? Oh, the, that's the GPU thing you do is, that's funny. So I can actually control it with motion controls and thumbsticks at the same time, which is always a way I prefer it, to be honest. I really, I've talked about it before. I'm not a huge fan of doing shooters on, um, uh, on console. Oh, hello. Uh. Shoot him in the eyes? Oh, yeah. Hello.
Oh. Nice. It's kind of fun. I didn't. I wasn't expecting a boss battle in this game. Adios, amigos. Uh, we're all closed in now. There's only one way to go forward. Man, this this game is just impossibly charming. What's that? Oh my god, it's Tekken! <laughs> no more bow. Oh, monkey mode again? Alright, monkey time. Zip me up, guys. Chat, zip me up. Thank you. Alright, here we go. Okay, I, should, I had a feeling I was going to have to do that. I feel like I didn't have to be too... Uh-oh, what do I do now? Uh, okay, we, we good. Monka. Monka please. Monka S. We don't have any monkey emotes, otherwise I'd say monkey in chat. Ow. I may have just smacked my desk with my hand. Kill them, or I think I just have to. I just think I have to get past them. I don't think I can kill them as monkey. It's just kind of enjoyable, I'll be honest. This is where it's like this thing of like now it's just at a point here where I feel like it's kind of just me playing the game. Um. Actually, I think there's an area to the right. We'll go to the right. Yeah, I was right. Adios. <laughs> hmm. That felt a little weird. Oh. Too fast. Uh oh. I've got, to, I've got to speed up the pace. Animal abuse? I would never abuse a monkey. Oh, so it's really funny that both Sony and Nintendo did this at the same time. It was like a, so this is like you strapped the controller to it. So like in the front, I'm fairly sure, or unless it was built into this one. In the Nintendo one, you would put like a Wii controller in and then you would have like an adapter. And so like Link's crossbow training. And then there was this, this gun was very comfy. I never played with this. This was one that was just built in. That's probably why, because you probably would have had to have gotten an additional peripheral. Oh, yep. I feel like I'm kind of concentrating now, at this point. Oh, this must be the end. Monkey! Successfully completed. Oh, look, it's another, it's another title screen. Look. This is the PS... Was this the PS3? The PS3 had the Aurora, wasn't it? 
I haven't had my PS4 on a default themed one in a long time. I'm fairly sure the Aurora was the 3. Unless this is the 4. Monster Escape. And PS4 has it too. I never had a PS3. I think I think both of them had the Aurora, didn't they? I might be wrong though. We'll find out. We'll see what console this is. It is the PS4, so it is the PS4's one. Yeah. Journey reference here on the snow. Oh, I didn't see it. Uh, yeah. This is this is literally what I'm transferring games over from. It's apparently still transferring, and I have no idea how long that's going to take. But uh, ever wanted to see me do? You ever do this with a console? Do you ever just flick it around? Look how lightweight it is. I wish I could move it with a thumbstick. That's the only thing, just to realign it. Yeah. I love my PS4. PS4. Oh, I have I've loved ever actually. Every one of my PlayStations, I'll be honest. PS2 is probably the one I have the least amount of games on, I'll be honest. Look at that brick. I accidentally did that to my PS4 at the back of a truck when it was moving. Clunk, 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 clunk. Nice. Well, I... We've done this for like an hour and a half. You want me to keep going? Because I think, I think I've represented it well. Um, kind of wanted to keep playing it, but maybe this might be one of those things that uh, I could... Uh, oh, there's that little dino we were talking about. Um, I'm probably... I'm halfway through it now. Oh, that one was actually hard to open. Some of them are harder to open than others for some reason. Maybe I'm doing it when the gear pops out. I have a PlayStation 1, 2, and 3, and 4. I want a PS5, we can't afford the six, $800. Well, the thing is, there's very few available right now. Oh, it's the uh, chunky PS4. Original PS4. Wait, no, this is a PS4 Pro. I'm totally wrong. Oh, it says in the top left-hand corner. I don't know why I don't read the top left-hand corner. Because I've got the original PS4. Eh, eh, eh. Fine. Have it your way, machine. Man, there's so much to collect in this game. Yeah. Yeah, I realized it was a pro after I took a moment. I'm too quick on the gun. I wonder if the PS5 appears in the middle once you complete it all. What is he doing? Oh, they're all disc cartridges. The one thinner original PS4. In we go. Uh, alright. Well, we seem to be still unlocking stuff, apparently. Didn't know what that was. More, more heights, more speed runs. This is a proper game though, which is nice. So, fun fact. So I can see all my achievement, all those things. I can look at all the trophies. I can look at the past things I've done. Um, actually, what's this game base? Got it, okay. Make parties. Oh, I can still silver playing. Updates, downloads. This is my, oh my God, data transfer, 10 hours. What? I don't know what's up with demons, but we'll have a look in a minute. Um, like my notifications. So this is the this is the new game bar. I actually like this game bar a lot better than the other one because if you ever did the old one, it actually would go to the menu, and I didn't like that so much. And you can see you, you how much battery you've got pretty uh, pretty easily. So I'm gonna have to definitely charge this up. Um, press and hold. So, one of the big things about this game is... Oh, shit, guys. Look what's finished already. So, you can actually swap between games pretty easily. Um, which we could probably run... Do you want to see what running two PS5 games looks like? 
So I feel like maybe we should do it. I think maybe that's where we'll stop with Astros for today. I will maybe, I'll probably complete this. Um, I think maybe we'll do a second part to Astros next week. I'll do Astros and Demon Souls. Um, and uh, yeah, for now, I think, or in a few days rather, maybe we should swap over to Bug Snacks. I can show you what it looks like to have two games running. Um, I also want to see what world looks like uprezzed. Yeah. Now, how do I go back to the game now? How do I go back to the game? We just go like that and we're back. Okay. All right. And that's really snappy too. That was really fast. Okay. Cool. All right. Well, time to swap over. So maybe we'll do a tiny bit of bug snacks. Bug snacks. 